Of the 12 people who died last month from COVID-19 in New Hampshire, state health officials say two were considered fully vaccinated. But they say that shouldn't deter you from getting the vaccine. This vaccine is highly effective at preventing COVID-19. It is not perfect and no vaccine is. But if you look at all the cases that have occurred since the vaccine has been introduced, 99% of them have occurred in unvaccinated people. Dr. Beth Daly, chief of the Bureau of Infectious Disease Control, says even though transmission in our state is low, COVID-19 is in our communities and precautions are still recommended. COVID-19 is still here. These low levels of transmission doesn't mean it's not a risk. So it doesn't really change our messaging that people should be aware of COVID-19, could be in our communities that you should continue to take precautions that you normally would about preventing illness, like washing your hands. The seven-day rolling average of new COVID-19 cases is now less than 25 a day, but the state is keeping a close eye on the numbers and the variants. At this point, DHHS says 15 Granite Staters have tested positive for the Delta variant, but that number could rise. We do know that it has been increasing in incidents across uh, the country and even globally, and so we might expect to see more cases in the future, and we should continue to monitor it. And because COVID-19 transmission is low in our state right now, state health officials say that even those who are not vaccinated do not have to wear masks unless they choose to.